It's time for the official release and demo of our game-changing Windows 11 X Lite build, Neon Knights Pro. Its primary design is to boost performance, privacy, and control, but also includes many additions and changes to provide you with an enhanced experience. In the Settings app, you'll see automatic updates are paused until the year 3000. They are only paused to offer you the freedom of choice whether to use them or not. If you want to use auto-updates, just click the Resume Updates button. Updating this build will not affect any of the tweaks, settings, privacy, or performance that this build provides. In the Personalization menu, you'll see additional themes have been included that will change the look of your mouse cursor and desktop wallpaper. In the Start menu, you'll see we've added two apps to the Startup folder that enable system transparency and launch a customized neon theme dock along the taskbar. In the XLite Tools folder, you'll find apps and shortcuts designed to give you more control while using Neon Knights Pro. And in the Apps folder, you'll see there are no pre-installed Windows apps, as this build focuses on giving the end user more control and choice by letting you choose what Windows apps to install. In the Extras folder, you'll find additional desktop shortcuts that can help you easily change your username, add additional users, change advanced power settings, and more. Snap Layouts and the Snap Bar are disabled by default, but in the Registry Tweaks folder, we've included files you can run to enable or disable the new Windows 11 Snap features. After running any of these files, right-click the desktop and select Restart Explorer to activate them. And in the Wallpaper folder, we've added some additional neon-themed pictures to enhance the look of your desktop. Now I'll explain how you can easily enable or disable the included system transparency and the included neon theme dock in this build. If you open Task Manager and go to the Startup Apps tab, you'll see an app called Clear.exe, which enables the system transparency, and an app called Rocket Dock. They're both enabled by default. To disable them, right-click on either of the apps and then click Disable followed by signing out to complete the changes. If you want to enable them again, open Task Manager, navigate to the Startup Apps tab, and change them back to Enabled, and sign out again. And if anyone was wondering, installed in a virtual machine, this build uses as little as 0.3 gigabytes of RAM at idle. Virtual memory has been enabled by default. And this build has full support for all language, speech, and voice features. All right, now as mentioned, there are no pre-installed Windows apps in Neon Knights Pro. But in the extras folder, we've included a Microsoft Store installer that you can use to add any Windows apps that you may desire. We'll show you how to install the MS Store and show you just how easy it is to add any apps you desire through it as well.
your feet So give it your best But believe that I have got the strength inside You can find your way to get to me But the only way that this will end is in retreat You think you're better, but I know better Cause you're not different to anybody else And I'm gonna prove in time That no heart's as strong as mine No way to pierce my skin There's no flesh and blood here So you're gonna have to try To find another way We hope you enjoy using our game-changing Neon Knights Pro build. Please visit our Ko-Fi page, hit that like and subscribe button. Until next time, take care.